Hi, it's Diggin. Uh, thanks for joining me. I'm glad you're back. Um, thanks for joining me on The Vibe. Um, it, this evening, I'd like to talk about a dream I had a couple of years ago. And this dream was about Pres Obama and uh, his wife. And in my dream, um, I saw them in their bedroom and they were just waking up. Um, um, and I thought, oh, well, okay. Um, like I, and I saw her turn to her husband. She was laying on her left side. And um, she said, you know, good morning, something or other. And he just snapped at her. He was really mean. And then um, I heard a pause. And in this pause, I saw that he was really struggling to stay focused in his own skin. Um, um, I had understood in that dream that about six weeks, I guess, prior to that, he had had uh, some surgery on his head and something was put in his head. Um, and this thing that put in that was put in his head, it appears that um, his struggle was trying to maintain um, himself, like I said, his personality um, in his skin. Um, whatever was put into his head began to take him over. So he would have these outbursts of anger and irritation and then recompose. I mean, even um, having to excuse himself sometimes and just taking time out, you know, where he could recompose. And like I said, um, it was like whatever had been implanted in his head, in his brain, uh, was taking over the personality of Barack Obama. Um, I know this sounds really, really, really weird, and you might go, okay, well, you know, this is kind of old news, and the reason I'm saying it's kind of old news is because um, after this, as of lately, it's just been coming to me and coming to me and coming to me and coming to me, um, um, and, and I went, okay, I'm going to get on YouTube, and I'm going to research this, and I'm going to Google the hell out of, or the heck, excuse me, out of what it is that I'm seeing in order to understand. A, a, a part, as time went on in my dream, um, a part of it, what I was seeing was making me really sad. Like I felt really, really, really sad. And I felt sad because what they showed me, I, I mean, I remember his wife, Michelle, asking him, does it hurt when he was irritated and snapped and he was mean? You know, she was sincerely genuine, genuinely concerned you know does it hurt you know and no and but like I said you know him and his personality isn't you know completely that that staunch that 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 mean so when I kept on looking and I didn't understand um, my dream and okay why was I there why was I seeing this as I continued to look and and you know observe what was going on in the dream um, uh, I saw that this and I'm going to say entity and the reason I'm going to use the word entity or or another consciousness is because, like I said, there seems to be a battle in his brain and he was striving so hard to stay in his skin. But as time went on, as hard as he tried, to everybody's dismay, what ended up happening and so what ultimately does happen happen is this personality this intelligence or consciousness very unfortunately but it takes him over completely so the barack obama that we know that michelle loves um eventually is gone completely gone in my dream, there was no more. This AI or this consciousness um, um, took him over completely. And then who you saw as 
President Barack Obama really wasn't Pres Obama. His shell was, you know, his body, but what possessed that body was no longer Barack Obama. So when, um, uh, when his term, you know, second term was done, I thought to myself, huh, I thought about the dream and I thought, what did that mean exactly? What did that mean? So I do know that even though his second term is over, I know that there's something in the making. That's definite. Because why would this AI or, or consciousness, why would it have the need to take him over completely? His being, his intelligence, his uh, his his soul. You, you know, um, um, there was no more Barack Obama, and and this person was a whole brand new person. Now, um, I I went on the the internet and I started to take a look because I thought something's got to give me confirmation here and i stumbled um i stumbled across something that kissinger said and kissinger said that um he as well as others were waiting for barack obama to complete the new world order or to create the new world order that he was somehow um taken into a lead He's become the lead of this NWO. And then when I was like, oh, wow, 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 wow. I think I hit on something here. I think the dream really, really meant, you know, a warning. It was a real warning. And not only did I need to understand, other people needed to understand, you know, as to why uh, these changes were surfacing and going to uh, uh, surface. Uh, the other, uh, sometime in um, May, I guess, I think, um, uh, he, he took a trip to Korea and met with the, 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 the president of South Korea. Um, uh, he was there for a business meeting and what would he be doing there when that relationship and that business, um, that conversation should have been with, with your president, um, Donald Trump. So, you know, it's showing that, that Mr. Obama is still at work and, and are we looking at, at him working behind the scenes and Donald Trump being the image and working in the front scene? Um, because when you stop and, and, and you look and you connect the dots, um, uh, 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 Mr. Obama hasn't gone anywhere and nor do I see him going anywhere um, outside of the top of the pile. You know, when you have somebody like Kissinger making a comment like this, there is a clear understanding, you know, and this was after election, this was after Donald Trump had come in, that, that you know, he made that statement that this was um, what everybody was waiting for because Mr. Obama, President Obama, was the one to begin and to finish this. So, um, 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 the question really is, um, who is... President Obama becoming, and who will he be? Um, you and I, everybody will notice the difference, um, and and stop and take a look at you know uh, what happened and how what kind of an explosion and what kind of impact um, he had made on the whole world when he entered um, uh, this scene and ran for presidency. Um, we all know that, you know, there's selection um, and there's election. Uh, but this, I really have to say that even he, because, you know, he was the first to go, oh, hey, I will, I will, I will volunteer. 
So, you know, for, for you know, this upload, you know, um, uh, for all these different changes, um, you know, there is something really big on the horizon. Um, I know that we all know that what this is, and, and that is um, uh, the fact that the NWO, whether we like it or not, is now here, and it's here to stay. Um, we do need to watch um, and really pay attention um, to uh, this president um, because, you know, he might have left office in Washington, even though he's still doing a lot of the president's job, even though he's not president. Why would the world leaders embrace this, take the time out, have conversations with him, do business with him when they know he is not president, that his term was up. So I really have to say there's something to this um, because I'm not the only one that had dreams like this. Um, I never heard anybody mention that, that there was an implant, that there was artificial intelligence, that um, um, a consciousness was uploaded into his brain and um, uh, nobody, as of yet, the only other person that could confirm this would be his wife, Michelle, because she was there in the conversation when she said, are you okay? Does it hurt? Um, so here, I better stop doing my own thing. Um, <laughs> I did it again. Uh, here we have to watch and we have to understand that even though his term is over, we are going to see a lot of Mr. Obama. I'm going to say that very unfortunately, and like I said, it really makes me sad where I saw that he was going to be completely taken over and there was going to be no more uh, Barack. And instead, uh, Barack, even though he keeps that name, uh, uh, is actually another entity. So, I thought I'd share that weird dream with you. Um, maybe if you have a different light on this, on this dream or you get a different meaning, uh, to me, it means, like I said, heads up. To me, it meant, okay, you need to talk about this now. This is a bit of information that people for whoever it is, maybe all of us, uh, need to know this. So I'm going to say until the next video, uh, let me know what you think. I hope you liked the video. <laughs> uh, stick around. I have a lot to say and I've got a lot to share. If you like, like, hit like and subscribe. Okay, until then, I bid you an adieu. I'm going to say it's nice talking to you. See you soon.